I turned pro in uh, 2006 and I was uh, 25 back then and uh, before turning pro I finished my degree in engineering which uh, I think is quite unique for a professional golfer and so I've always liked the uh, stats, I've always liked physics and uh, obviously I love using Trackman. When the Trackman 4 came out it was uh, very interesting I thought because uh, it was the first time that you could get some numbers on the short game and so it was last winter, I was at home, it was uh, quite cold. So one day I just decided to, to try it out and test it out. And uh, I just started to hit some different shots, different distances. And uh, I was trying to hit some lower shots, some higher shots, some shots that spin a bit more, spin a bit less. And just uh, then taking a look at the numbers and see how the numbers were changing. Because uh, again, up until then, no one really had uh, any numbers on, on short game. I surely had a few surprises. Uh, I think the biggest one was that I always thought that I was uh, very shallow with my attack angle. And I am very shallow because if I hit a pitch shot from 30, 40 yards, I hardly take any divot. And still my attack angle was like five, six down. So I was surprised to see that. I would have thought it was more like one or two down. I think uh, after using Trachman, I learned that uh, in order for the ball to zip back on the green, you probably need to have a, a landing angle about 40 degrees, sometimes even steeper. And the spin rate has to be 8,000 RPM, sometimes even more. It just depends how firm the green is. But generally those numbers will give you a nice low trajectory with, with a lot of spin.